um, back again today. Uh, Mac, well, it's not Mac tip. It's me installing uh, Windows XP Professional on VMware Fusion. A couple of you have asked me to do a Windows 7 one, but I couldn't burn the ISO onto a disk, and I kept on getting stuck. So I thought I'd just try the Windows XP version that I've got a proper disk of and it's not a beta or anything. So once again you just need to boot up your virtual machine, parallels, VMware, whatever. New, continue, it's picked it up straight away, continue. Uh, name it that for the time being this size only want 10 gig uh, knock it down to 5 actually that should be alright uh, I haven't got a product key because it's on the other computer so I'll just see if it does it without one two seconds Starting now, yes. Let's see if this baby runs. I'm not too sure if it will, guys. So if it don't, obviously there will be no video. But if it does, touch wood, it will. So this is just going through the Windows setup. As many of you will probably know if you've had. You've had to reformat machines before. This does take a lot longer than Linux, by the way. So, if it's taking too long, I'll just pause the recording. It's gone two minutes already, so it's just loading the files now. <coughs> Sorry, I've got a bit of a cold. Uh, VMware is very good though guys for installing other operating systems to run natively with your Mac OS X Leopard and as, as you can see what I did you don't need the most amount of hard disk space unless you're really using it for a job or work or school or college but well, I'm certainly going to be using mine for a quick go on every now and again mess around just to go back to Windows every now and again right so it's been three minutes now I'll stop it at five if it's still going and come back to it once it's done most of the things it needs to do This is the 32-bit version of Windows, or si I think it may. No, I don't know actually if it's 64-bit or 32-bit XP, but it's the one that comes with my Dell anyway. So still going on there. It's starting Windows now, so hopefully touch wood. It's formatting now. 5 gigabytes, which shouldn't really take long, as you can see 5106, oh that's pretty fast, now it's just setting it up, I think I'll be able to go on quite a while without a serial key, I'll just have to get one from somewhere, because I think you can use it for 30 days without a serial number, I've done it before so I'm sure of it. Right, it's coming up to five minutes guys so I am just going to stop this recording and export that one while this sets up so I'll see you in a minute so so far guys it's touch wood working it went through the installation progress quite simply 
no problems. Uh, 36 minutes approximately remaining, so I'll just do the same again and pause it about seven, eight minutes of our, if it's not done by then. Well, yeah, it's looking good. It's just how it looks when you install it on a Windows computer. So, hopefully this will be alright. I was going to do a Vista disk that I've got for the family's other computer, but I couldn't find it, so I just thought an XP is more stable, I know how to use XP a lot better than I do Vista, so... Hope you're enjoying these thingies anyway, guys, these videos. So this is just installing devices. It's nearly done the devices. Anyway guys, I can always pause it. That's the wonders of our movie. Ooh. We need the product key. So if I go and find the product key guys from somewhere, I will be able to put that in and I'll start again. See you soon. So I'm a happy bunny now, guys. Uh, my serial key I found on the old Dell worked. So that's alright. And hopefully, touch wood again, this is going to go fine. Uh, I think I'll pause it there again so I can get a couple of minutes showing you XP and VM for Fusion Wear. So I'll be back again. So Hold on in. Cheers. Everything's uh, installed and it was just uh, rebooting itself now. As you can see, sound drives have installed fine without me doing anything. And yeah, the display looks really nice. No. I'll just install something free later. See if the internet works. I might have to install some drivers. Touch wood for the 50th time today. Come on, please. Please, pleasey, please. This may run into two parts, guys. Uh, this one. Oh, ah, I know why that is. Because I've got the router unplugged. The, this may run into two parts, guys. So this part one will just be having a, the installation, basically. And then the next part, I'm going to do a guided tour of XP even though everyone knows what it is and I'll just show you a bit of it on VM so I will cancel this video here and do a review of Windows XP in VMware Fusion coming up next thanks a lot for staying in there guys Cheers.